Hi, this is Gerhard. Welcome to my watercolour demonstration of a terrier puppy, but painted on the back of light show card. I begin by sketching in with a 2B pencil. Straight lines help to establish the angles of the major shapes. Later putting in the curves where the lines meet. This isn't meant to be a finished drawing, it's a map to let you know where to put the colours. I start with a bit of light red, burnt sienna, mix the two up a bit, add a touch of cerulean blue and some burnt umber. Working all over don't concentrate on one little bit. Here I'm trying to make some darker shapes. I've added a little bit of Payne's grey in places. As you can see, the surface is quite absorbent. However, you do need to dry it off occasionally and a hair dryer does a magnificent job. Once dry I use a small fan brush to add some of the darks and simulate some of the uh, the hair. As you can see I'm also using a small rigger and I alternate between the two. Payne's Grey and Burnt Umber make a wonderful dark, especially good for the nose, the eyes, and even some of the detail in the shadows. Using that fan brush and some white titanium gouache, I add details of the uh, lighter fur as the gouache dries, it tends to go a lot paler, so I have to use multiple layers of it. I keep refining shapes, add some highlights to the eyes, working all over. The starkness of the white may be relieved by using light layers or glazing over the top with browns and shadow colours, the little greys that I've made up using that cerulean. Once it's dry, I have a long look and decide mm, I'll put in some background. So I've used some Tasman Blue with a little touch of the titanium mixed in here and there. Don't fuss, just paint it in very quickly. After that, I decide that the white fur needs to be restated. It's gone very pale. So once again, that little fan brush comes in handy. And again, modify the starkness of the white with a few different colours. Using a very fine round sable, I add dark details to the eyes and decide to put the highlights in a different place. Also add a few whiskers, both sides of the muzzle. I sign it with that same little brush and then Step back, take a photo. Thanks for watching.